Prime Minister has today agreed to an intelligence deal with Japan, which will allow both countries to share top secret information. And as Jacinda Ardern wrapped up the final day of her Tokyo visit, she and her Japanese counterpart sent China a warning. Here's political reporter Amelia Wade. What a welcome. Bit of a grapple with the official grasp. Well, maybe a high five. <laughs> before things getting serious. Yes. Today, I had a frank discussion with Prime Minister Ardern. Frank and fruitful, finalising a spy deal months in the making. The PM says the deal will mean we can formally share what intel we have in situations like the Tongan volcano eruption, but also much, much more than that. Up to the level of top secret and at our discretion, as I say, we're at the moment still in the process of negotiating the scope of the arrangement. The leader's making a point of being united against militarisation of the Indo-Pacific, a shot across China's bow. The superpower recently flying fighter jets over the South and East China Seas and signing its Solomon Security Pact. Attempts to unilaterally change the status quo by force cannot be allowed. So it is about demonstrating through global action uh, that there will be swift response. 